24. 24. I just wanted to make it known that none of these videos are in prison time and they might not be in prison time for a long time until I catch up and I don't know when that's going to be so like yeah you can have that expectation and if you're a person who knows me IRL these are events that happened and have shaped my life to what it is right now so yeah I think Asian people really snap when they put soy sauce on eggs. It's the best thing in the world. Good morning. So, this is basically me running through a typical research day, especially because I'm at home and doing nothing. Right? And I literally make something to eat chill for a bit like right now i'm sitting in the sun because it's quite cold like it's freezing my feet are actually frozen and i actually have to at some point set up a doctor's appointment for that because one of my toes are like not receiving enough blood from what i think like from what i see uh and i need to sort that out quickly uh but this is the typical research day all i do is sit in front of the computer submit stuff or just work on stuff. Today, um, today, I am busy with my proposal comments that I received. Last week I submitted, and then my supervisor gave me a few comments. Hopefully I can be done with them by Wednesday, but there are, there's one page that I actually want to finish today and send back so that we can discuss it on Wednesday because my proposal is almost done and I'd rather just have everything done before the first thoroughly even with the comments and everything and yeah and then I can look to registering my title and submitting it to the CAD it's been a long time coming I'm so glad I'm here <laughs> and you know what Russian avant-garde stuff you know what the thing about avant-garde is I know what the concept is but reading into it and like trying to explain it outside of the definition or like thoroughly is not that simple like it's it's not that simple <laughs> look at the amount of bees on the lavender it's actually a bit insane sausages and then I'm going to use these um it's actually non rotis 
um but then i'm gonna use like a wrap and then this gochugang paste this thing is so good And this is my lunch. Actually stopped working a bit of paint today. Mm. I hate winter. My body physically hates winter. It physically reacts to winter. Not even that like cold cold, but my arms are painful today, like the extreme painful. It feels like someone is pulling at them. My foot is not as much. I'm gonna set up a dog somewhere but now, but I just physically hate the cold. My body can't do it. So I'm just gonna really relax until like three and try see what's up. Hopefully like I, my my fingers will feel better because my fingers really really feel like someone is beating me up. I really do struggle with drinking water in winter. Like, yo, I guys get bands, and I'm in the man the bands are like I can't do warm water. I feel like water tastes different at different temperatures and tastes nicer when it's cold. Like, yeah. Anyways, drink your water. I just tried to. I called the doctor like three times and it put me through to the answering machine thing my property okay shop and then nobody proceeds to answer it's just ringing 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 and i have this thing where i get discouraged by the smallest thing it was discouraging and then i wanted to cry because i actually need to set up an appointment because i'm actually in so much pain and then i was just sitting there like <sighs> contemplating my life now i'm searching to see if maybe the place is closed because it's like four and it doesn't have times and i'm just like going through a series of things that are unnecessary and i'm overthinking it but like i now i'm at a point where i just want to cry for no reason except for the fact that i just hate when i try to do something and it doesn't happen anyway yeah i guess i'm gonna have to call them tomorrow and try set up a doctor's appointment but it's also my fault for calling now at four like come on cheryl Um, I just made myself a cup of tea and I'm gonna start preparing dinner I've become a vegetarian and I don't mind it like I do eat meat occasionally but I'm by nature now <laughs> I'm kidding we just tend to predominantly make vegetarian meals because my cousin is also a vegetarian but these are my ingredients and for protein we have butter beans um, I love these so much <music> because I'm kind of tired of being closet but I'm gonna go back to doing my school work I can't see properly but 
when I pack it out. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna do my schoolwork and then I'm gonna go make a cup of tea. And I'm gonna go take a shower and go to bed. But I just wanna sit here and read, really. So I have a couple of articles I need to read through and then I'm going to send this to myself as well. Schedule it for tomorrow morning at 8. I like doing that. As opposed to sending it at 4 because she'll probably see it first thing in the morning. And yeah, this is what a typical day doing research looks like really at ho if I'm at home. <laughs> So I eventually got a doctor's appointment, but then I forgot what time it is. Lovely, lovely stuff. But I'm gonna have my cup of tea, and I'm gonna shower and go to bed. Flossing. Let me show you. So you pull the floss out, right? Wrap around the one finger. You work with two fingers. Huh? Two hands. No. I'm just gonna take some before I finish flossing. Then you wrap on this side. A lot of people tend to like wrap on this on the left. I cannot. I use my right. Just my dominant hand. I don't know why. So. If I wrap this way, right, I'm going to start this side and then I'm going to floss, right, I take it out and where it was dirty, I just wrap it around, move on, unravel, move on, floss again, wrap, unravel, you see, that's how you floss. <laughs> That was a full day of me doing research. I just realized that I didn't send my email to my supervisor yet. When I schedule it for 8 o'clock, then I'm gonna go to bed. Well, I hope you guys had a good day, or you're having a good day, or you plan on having a good day, depending on whatever time you watch this. And yeah, good night from my side. appointment today and I have to submit something so I'm gonna work on that I actually did it last night but I don't know I don't know why I was like overthinking it like I have this thing where with writing I know what to do and then I'll do it and then I'll overthink it and then I like I get stuck in this process and then it's like when I had a discussion this morning with everyone and they were just like why are you overthinking it? And I'm just like, I don't know. I think the key to research is to treat it like it's a nine to five, like wake up in the morning, like you're going to work, get the day started, get your research started. It really does help with some sort of structure because back in the day, I would sleep, I would just go to the library, which also helped the function. But now that I'm not, I try to treat like as a work thing. Like right now, I'm gonna have lunch. I had breakfast and then I had my research that I was doing. Now I'm having lunch. Then I'm gonna go out to my doctor's appointment. After that, I'm gonna come back, do my research. Then I think at four, I'm gonna call it a day. Cause today I barely procrastinated, even though I procrastinate a bit, but I didn't procrastinate to a point where I didn't do anything, I did a lot. So then there's no need for me to carry on through the night. But if I want to, I will.
doctor and they took my blood then depending on what happens or what they find or what they don't find i they're gonna call me back and see what's up and i got medication just to help with the inflammation because he thinks my joints are inflamed which is trying to something i also think it is like because i go through that and he was talking about arthritis kidneys kidneys i see arthritis i'm like okay cool whatever kidneys he said you must check your kidneys yes i'm gonna mash but i'm gonna go to bed but i'm gonna have a cup of tea before bed <music> past 11 I woke up at like half past 4 and then I went back to sleep at like 20 past 7 and then I woke up now like it's such a gloomy day and my body actually just wanted to just not do anything today but I've, I've got to do some readings and I'm attending a lecture for the first time in a long time okay. I'm attending an honors lecture and I'm, like my supervisor just wanted me to share my experience of working in an office because of like the conversations we have in our supervision meeting so she asked me if i want to like talk about it because in general she's going to be talking about what there's in the class today so i'm excited for that just to experience a class it sort of makes me feel a bit normal about the fact like it's not like my life is not normal it's just when you don't attend lectures anymore i haven't attended a lecture since covid so i just feel really weird man it feels like i'm in school but i'm not and then i also forget sometimes that i am a student but you yeah. Again, this right spread on this first then an apple she has kiss so I had a lecture today I attended a lecture which is nice dinner is served 